and gentlemen, and welcome to the fourth annual Homecoming Parade! Let's start out with those three magic words. We are... Cheerleaders, I'm going to start us off with a cheer to get this thing off with the bang after the band has already got that going for us. Go ahead, cheerleaders. So much to celebrate. We certainly enjoy having our alumni back, and we're going to talk about that here in just a little bit. We want to thank, though, first of all, the most important people, which is our students. Our students being here is a big part of that. We want to also thank our staff, our parents, and we certainly want to thank all the families who are part of this special evening, because this is this is certainly special to everybody down here. Also want to thank our board of education. I've seen a few of them here tonight. We thank them for all the support that they give us and our kids throughout the year. At this time, we are going to bring our homecoming court on, and I would like to introduce to you our advisor. Please put it together loud for Miss Deb Allen. Hi, everybody. We're going to start with our 2023 king and queen just to have them come one more time in front of everybody so joe hefner and raya evans please come up to the
And our last King and Queen candidates are Jenna Snyder and Micah Talley. Jenna is the daughter of Mick and Amy Snyder. Micah is the son of Crystal White. I would like to invite all of you to tomorrow night's festivities. The Queen crowning will happen at halftime of the football game. The King crowning happens at the dance on Saturday night. Thank you, let's give it up for Homecoming Court 2024. Great to see our 2023 Homecoming King and Queen as well. Before we bring out the next people, we want to take an opportunity to thank one person in particular that really made this thing happen. Now, first of all, sound goes to Mark Eller. Thanks, Mark, for taking time to come out and make sure you got, that got done for us so people can hear us. But the person that makes all this thing behind the scenes, and we want to give her a big shout out, maybe we can hit some drums and some uh, cymbals, uh, Mrs. Emily Schaller for making all this thing. Amazing amount of time. We had several people go through the, groups go through the parade. We want to make sure that we acknowledge those groups. We want to congratulate our girls and boys golf teams and acknowledge them tonight. Girls in particular end up with nine wins this year, most we've had in a long time. Yes. The ever so popular cross country float always brings some entertainment. Uh, boys in particular have had a great year. They've won multiple championships and they're looking hopefully to go to a back-to-back -back regional for the first time in school history. Soccer team, big win for girls and boys soccer. Big wins over this week over Greenville. Congratulations to them. Glad to have our volleyball team. Let's get up to our volleyball team. make our athletes behind the scenes take care of them they get not a lot of recognition so let's give this time opportunity to give them our student athletic trainers and our athletic trainers David and Katie we can't forget about the group that gets everybody fired up and that's our cheerleaders cheerleaders thank you for all you guys do let's yell for them right now And the people that are making all the sound and, and all the noise here, the pride of Piqua. They have already locked in their spot for the state here in a few weeks. So congratulations for once again getting to state. And last but not least, we like to acknowledge our football team who tomorrow night has a big contest against West Carrollton. And to talk about that a little bit more is our head football coach, Coach Bill Neese. Thank you, everybody. It's good to see everybody out tonight. We've got four of our players up here with us that have volunteered to come out and share their thoughts on homecoming and uh, how well they're going to do tomorrow night with the victory. When they get finished, we're going to bring the rest of our senior class up, and they're going to start helping the crowd with uh, bringing up 250 t-shirts. So as soon as they're done, everybody get ready and we'll get rolling. The first guy I'd like to introduce is our offensive tackle, Jace Webb. This year, this is Jace Weber. Uh, I'm already picking up. But uh, now I'm going to pick up and I'm going to pick up on it. That's why I picked up. Let's go! <laughs> Next up, we have offensive guard, Kenny Ball. Uh, I want to say thank you guys all for coming out. Uh, make sure you come out tomorrow. We'll get that win. Go pick one. 
extra offensive lineman, defensive lineman, and Elijah Bushnell. Thank you all for coming out. Make sure you show up tomorrow. Go pick one. Step up there now in a rare couple of pairs. We've got free safety, Mike and T. Give us a few thoughts on tomorrow night's day. I want to say uh, thank you for coming out. Uh, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Seniors, come on up. The rest of the seniors are going to come up and then get ready here. They're going to start firing some t-shirts out. Emily, is that right? Is that how you do it? All right, very good. Get us set. Thank you. See everybody tomorrow night. Back up Chip Heron, he's going to close up the ceremony, so again, appreciate everybody coming out tonight. All right, before I get going here, one more thing that we need to acknowledge, and let's make sure that I make sure that I mention this, girls tennis this year, our, our girls tennis coach said, we're going to struggle a little bit, we lost a lot of seniors, we're going to have one senior, we're pretty young. Yeah, they ended up finished nine and eight with the winning record, consecutive third year in a row for winning record for the girls tennis program. Let's go up for girls tennis. But we need to get fired up a little bit. All right, so here we go. We are gonna go trumpets, all right, trumpets. All right, we're gonna do Teddy. Here we go, Teddy.
Coach Whiteman, we're gonna, Coach Whiteman, we're gonna do a couple more cheers in just a minute. We'll give you a minute to get that together. But before we do those cheers, whatever you guys want to do, can you guys can pick here. But before we do those cheers, we're going to announce the alumni distinction. We have three people here tonight that we have brought back that have been nominated. That were they were nominated, and then they were actually will be tomorrow night inducted into the Hall of Fame for our uh, honorees for our alumni of distinction. These people are pretty special. They're making a major contribution to our citizen, to our communities and extended communities. So when you hear their name, let's please make sure that we acknowledge them and give them a proper We Are Pickle welcome. Our first one, Erica Hamilton. Our second one, Suzanne Peretti. Some people might have heard this guy. Our last one is from the class of 91, Mr. Tom Westfall. Can we get a We Are Pickle cheer before we go? Can we get that? And then we're going to finish with the fight song. All right, cheer, here we go. We Are Pickle cheer. Go, Pickle! Be Pirates! 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 Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for coming out tonight. We appreciate your energy. Remember those three important words. Let's say it together. We. Are